Hello, Cancer. Rambling Mike here. Going to play a little bit of tarot with you, my friends. Thanks for tuning in again one more time. Appreciate your view. You know I do. Thanks for hitting that old like button while you're thinking about it. And if you haven't hit that subscription button, thanks for doing that now. Always a big shout out from me to many, many, many of my cancer friends. Hey, if you ever blessed me in any way, shape, or form, cancer, thank you so very much. So very kind of you. I appreciate it all. Large or small. We're doing quick shots. We're going to take a, a little quick look at love and money. We're going to start with money. The Money Moves Oracle right here. And then we're going to look at love. I'm playing with the uh, Romance Angels and my favorite, Terra Illuminati. We're going to top it off with a couple of majors from the black and the gold, 22. All that being said, cancer, money, honey, money, honey, cancer, money come to cancer. Money moves towards cancer. Let's see. Here we go. Cancer, what's going on? Expression, expression. This is uh, opening your heart and connecting with others. It says expressing your creative self as well. Opening your heart and connecting with others. Expression. Expressing your creative self. Money, honey. Money, honey. Cancer. Wellness came out. Oh, a beautiful healing card. A beautiful healing card just showed up. No wonder we are opening the heart and connecting with others. The beautiful wellness card. Now, that's a card of healing. Mentally, emotionally, physically, spiritually, financially. Healing came out, and, and for some of you, it says I'm living a healthier lifestyle. But that is that energy is definitely more a healing card for me. Opening your heart and connecting with others. Oh wow, you cleared a cycle. Well, we just had a huge uh, eclipse um, last night as I'm recording this. This says that a uh, cycle is over. <laughs> hey, man. Hey, man. It's nice how often this card's coming out around here. A cycle is over. It's time for change. It's time for rebirth. Cancer. It's time to say goodbye. Well, let's do that. Let's, let's do that. Bye, Lack. Bye-bye. Bye-bye, Lack. Bye-bye, knuckleheads, jellyfish. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. We are out of here. We are out of here. Opening your heart and connecting with others. Could be some new friends. Uh, wellness. A beautiful card of healing. Mentally, emotionally, physically, spiritually, financially. And a declaration right there that the cycle is over. Give me more. Cancer. Cancer, babies. Oh, definitely over. Red doors being slammed around here. Who left that door open? Bam, you're letting all the flies in. Bam, shutting doors over here. That's a reset. That's a reset button right there. Reset. Love and money. Cancer. Oh, there you are back on your throne. There you are. That's the power card came out, Cancer. That's my birthright card. Oh, we are walking in our birthright again. Back on your throne. Walking in your authority, your power, your dominion. Very nice. This says you have the power to take control of your life, your career, your finances. Focusing on your needs. I'm really excited. I'm really excited. This is a beautiful spread, what I call healthy selfishness. It's absolutely beautiful. Expressing your creative self, living a healthier lifestyle. Time to say goodbye. Slamming red doors around here. Back on your throne again. The power card. Wow, 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 wow. Oh, and, and the love affair. This one's coming out here too for a lot of my friends. It's that one that says, don't lose your mind. Don't lose your mind about uh, the love affair. 
<laughs> Don't lose your mind about love because I got you. It says you're opening your heart and connecting with others. Got a healing card. Got a cycle that has ended over here. Got you back on your throne. And then it indicates some kind of love. It says, don't lose your mind. Don't lose your mind. Let's take a look at love. Let's take a look at love, Cancer. Here we go. Couple of cards. Cancer love. Cancer love, love team. Cancer love. Let's go. Cancer babies. Cancer babies. Here we go. Here we go. Cancer. Love. What is that? A honeymoon? See, there's a love boat. It says don't lose your mind. <laughs> it's got you back on your throne. You ended a cycle right here. It's opening your heart. The, the honeymoon card came out. Cancer, the love boat. The love boat just showed up on your spread. Shutting all those red doors, man. Wow, oh, a safe place to love. Well, go on. Go on, my manifester. This one says, again, open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all. This one says, enjoy the bliss of time together. A love boat showing up around here. Something about a safe place to love. What is this? A past life lover? A past life lover? Maybe you've already met him in the 3D. I don't know. Could be a past life lover showing up on this love boat anyway, man. Again, the second time it says to open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all. Oh, and make the effort. Ooh, this is a this is a great love card. A great love. Great loves were taking the steps that we are guided to take. Wow, cancer. Heart to heart conversations. Honestly discussing your feelings with each other. Ooh la la. Well, let's play some tarot on this. Cancer. 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 You know, when I get these kind of cards right here, you know, these past life lovers, um, I would never be referring to, you know, um, an ex that you don't want to deal with. That is so easy not to deal with them. We just don't answer the door. We, we check our little ring it's on the outside of our door. Oh, I ain't opening that door. Or we don't pick up the phone. And, uh, you know, if you do pick it up, you just pick it up and you go like this. Block. Anyway, this is a sweet energy. It started with honeymoon and a safe place to love. Something about a past life lover. You may have already met him. And then uh, the beautiful, beautiful picture right here of a little, a little boy kissing a little sugar baby on the face and then honestly discussing feelings with each other tell me more hey tell me more cancer it's a nice fresh energy here for you twice it said open your heart to love let's go terra luminati cancer cancer i feel i have to explain six of cups because a lot of people get turned off by all that Whew, and, and you may be getting turned off by the devil the first card out. Oh, my God, man. Yeah, we don't want to play with any of that past energy right there. That's a big old devil showed up around here. Um, I call the devil breaking chains that bind. And um, there's a healing right here. This is about breaking chains that bind. Give me something on that devil right there. That devil right there. Ah, uh, it could be a return of a, a toxic ex. It could be with a page right there, but you know, their name comes up on the phone. If you don't want to pick it up, don't pick it up. This could be a forewarned, forearmed right here with these two cards that came out. Um, that um, it's time for you to look for a new love. Yeah, a world card came out. About an old cycle ending and a new cycle beginning. No, I wouldn't go backwards. The devil showed up. And, and this is the apology card many times. Um, but a world card came out behind that. It says that cycle's over if you're resonating with this. I wouldn't even pick up the phone. 
Look at look at uh, what's coming in here on the other side of the world card. That one, Cancer, the Ten of Pentacles. The little white picket fence and the big pink house, the loving couple, the power couple. I wouldn't go backwards either, man. <laughs> I wouldn't go backwards either. Tell me what's going on around here. A new world. Breaking chains that bind. And heading towards ten pinnacles. The little white picket fence and the big pink house. Cancer. Cancer. Give me one right here. <laughs> oh, Cancer. Oh, boom, diddy, boom, boom just showed up. Now, that's a passionate new beginning. A passionate new beginning showed up around here. Oh, I love this energy. Bottom of the deck is three pinnacles. This is a card of collaboration. Building a new foundation with somebody that's important to you and you're important to them. What is this? Is this some power couple? Eight. Eight pins. Eight pins. Three pins. Ten pins. On an ace of wands. Ooh la la. Ooh la la. And uh, definitely, definitely a hell no to the past is on here. <laughs> yeah. When I said that to Warrior. What you talking about, Willis? No, we got that wall. <laughs> we got that world shut down over there, Mikey. We got that world shut down. We, we, we pulled the plug on that one. We pulled the plug on that one right there. Boom, tower, that's over, that's over. <laughs> oh. Okay, back to the now, back to the present. Cancer, nice stuff. Ace of Wands, three pinnacles, eight pinnacles, ten pinnacles on your new world. But your love cards, give me one right here. It is a new beginning. It is a new beginning. Um, Seven of Cups, uh... Well, you know, Seven of Cups is about ghouls and goblins and ghosters and toasters. That's how I read it right there. But there's always one. I always see one character up there in the Seven of Cups. And there's, there's communication. Uh, it was another coin. Uh, the Page of Pentacles. And the wheel spins. Cancer, love. Here we go. It's an omen of good luck and good fortune. Uh, looks new to me. If it's somebody that you have known here for a minute, this is definitely growing. Look at all the coins showing up with these two. Ten coins. Three coins. Eight coins. And a page of coins. Communication. And the wheel of fortune with these two. The wheel of fortune. The wheel of destiny. The wheel of change for the better. The wheel of winner, winner, chicken dinner. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's your, that's your ships coming in around here. Three Wands talks about ships coming in around here. The ship, possibly, huh, Cancer? Very, very nice energy right here about a solid new beginning. I would call them the power couple right here. It is the birthing of a power couple that I'm reading about right here. There is passionate communication. Um, this is somebody probably good looking, exciting, charismatic, fun to be with. They may have some fire in their chart, male or female. This is somebody magic. And uh, there's communication. If uh, communication that makes you feel good and this is the beginning of uh, a power couple is what I'm reading right here from my lovely lovely cancers what a beautiful beautiful change love that tower for you right there change for the better tower to the wheel give me a give me some cards right here a couple of major arcanas for my cancer got breakthrough man yeah, look, justice. Justice overall for you. Love and money. Justice came out. And the promise of the star as well. Cancer. Um, which is a very healing energy. Puts out hell fire. Justice to the star. That is uh, Libra. Aquarius energy right there. Wow, and a hierophant. 
a hair phantom that's spread right here. Again, an indicating of a power couple uh, putting it together, man. Outstanding reading. Yeah, it could have been because, again, uh, the moon card is showing up regularly. Uh, we just had that eclipse in Pisces. And the moon card can definitely talk about sudden changes. Sudden changes. Eclipsing people out of our life and eclipsing people into our lives very suddenly. Cancer. Real breakthrough here for you, man. Uh, if you made it this part in the reading, Cancer, thank you so very much for your view. Appreciate it. You know I do. Hopefully I've earned your subscription as one of your tarot readers. If I have, smash that subscription button. Huh? Ring my bell. Hit that old I like Mike button if you would. Justice. The star. And a hierophant. On your love and money cards. Absolutely beautiful, Cancer. May all your dreams come true. Love and light. Bye for now. All right, my Leo babies.